A cough dam is a temporary enclosure built within, or in pairs across, a body of water and constructed to allow the enclosed area to be pumped out, creating a dry work environment for the major work to proceed. Enclosed coffers are commonly used for construction and repair of oil platforms, bridge piers and other support structures built within or over water. These cough dams are usually welded steel structures, with components consisting of sheet piles, whales, and cross braces. Such structures are typically dismantled after the ultimate work is completed. For dam construction, two cough dams are usually built, one upstream and one downstream of the proposed dam, after an alternative diversion tunnel or channel has been provided for the river flow to bypass the dam foundation area. These cough dams are typically a conventional embankment dam of both earth and rock fill, but concrete or some sheet piling also may be used. Typically, Upon completion of the dam and associated structures, the downstream coffer is removed and the upstream coffer is flooded as the diversion is closed and the reservoir begins to fill. Dependent upon the geography of a dam site, in some applications, a U-shaped cough dam is used in the construction of one half of a dam. When complete, the cough dam is removed and a similar one is created on the opposite side of the river for the construction of the dam's other half. The cough dam is also used on occasion in the shipbuilding and ship repair industry, when it is not practical to put a ship in dry dock for repair or alteration. An example of such an application is certain ship lengthening operations. In some cases a ship is actually cut in two while still in the water, and a new section of ship is floated in to lengthen the ship. Torch cutting of the hull is done inside a cough dam attached directly to the hull of the ship. The cough dam is then detached before the hull sections are floated apart. The cough dam is later replaced while the hull sections are welded together again. As expensive as this may be to accomplish, use of a dry dock may be even more expensive. See also Kesson. A 100-ton open Kesson that was lowered more than a mile to the sea floor in attempts to stop the flow of oil in the deep way to horizon oil spill has been called a cough dam. It did not work as methane hydrates rose in the upper levels preventing the containment. Naval architecture. A cough dam may also refer to an insulating space between two watertight bulkheads or decks within a ship. A cough dam may be a void space or a ballast space. Cough dams are usually employed to ensure oil or other chemicals do not leak into machinery spaces. If two different cargoes that react dangerously with each other are carried on the same vessel, one or more cough dams are usually required between the cargo spaces. Portable cough dams Portable cough dams are inflatable cough dams that can be reused. Cough dams of this type are stretched across the site, then inflated with water from the prospected dry area. Once the area is dry, water still remaining from the dry area can be siphoned over to the wet area. References External links the Dictionary Definition of Cough Dam at Wikshinery, Nautical Terms at Fantastry.info, Portable Cough Dam at Fantastry.info. HTTP, www.demeatdams.com slash. Cough Dam.php.